Red Apple No, this episode is not about fruits. That's just how the name of the new Bayraktar drone, Kizil Elma, translates from Turkish. Kizil Elma is the first jet-powered UAV from this manufacturer. Its design heavily utilizes stealth technologies to make it less visible to radars. The Red Apple is adapted for takeoff from aircraft carriers and is designed for missile strikes, suppression of air defense systems, and reconnaissance. The Turkish landing strip Anadolu is supposed to become the carrier of the new aircraft, which would be the world's first such hub for UAVs. The novelty has impressive characteristics. The flight altitude is 7,500 miles. The range is almost 623 miles. The payload is 3,307 pounds and the maximum speed is up to 497 miles per hour. Kiziloma is planned to be produced in two versions, Mias A subsonic and Mias B supersonic. It is also planned that, in addition to tasks related to assaulting enemy positions, the aircraft will be able to perform fighter functions. The American corporation General Dynamics Land Systems has shattered the idea of a classic tank model by introducing a next-generation machine, the Abrams X. The tank is powered by artificial intelligence, allowing it to operate without a human pilot. One of the interesting features of the tank is its unmanned turret. This is a modern and well-thought-out approach because the turret is the most vulnerable part of the tank in combat. Thanks to this innovation, the tank crew is better protected, and their chances of survival in the event of an enemy projectile hit are much higher. The turret is equipped with two circular sights with laser, thermal, and other sensors. This helps to easily aim at any time of day and night and in any weather conditions. The Abrams X does not have a loader. This operation is fully automated and controlled by electronics. The machine is equipped with a hybrid engine, which reduces fuel consumption by almost half. Now, let's take a look into the world of water technologies. Unmanned technologies are also continuing to evolve here. Israeli company Aerospace Industries has created a unique unmanned combat boat called the Katana. This vessel is equipped with very cool technologies. Thanks to this, you can control the ship in the Pacific Ocean even while sitting on the beach in Tel Aviv. The boat can detect, track, and destroy a target that is at a significant distance from it. Modern weapons are used for this, the characteristics of which are still kept secret. At the customer's request, the ship can be equipped with any type of weapon. The vessel has a length of 40 feet, a width of 9.2 feet, and a maximum speed of 68 miles per hour. The mobility and firing rate of military vehicles should be given special attention, especially in defense. Introducing the Erlikon MK3 mobile gun. This versatile missile system is mounted on a truck, allowing it to be quickly moved from place to place as needed. The gun easily detects and shoots down aircraft and missiles, even during a massive attack. Moreover, the detection and destruction of enemy objects occur automatically. The installation can fire various types of projectiles. Combined with airburst technology, this makes the gun an effective weapon for destroying virtually all aerial and ground targets. The Erlikon MK3's rate of fire is 1,000 shots per minute, and the projectile's muzzle velocity exceeds 4,593 feet per second. The firing range reaches up to 3 miles. The system can detect a dangerous object at a distance of up to 30 miles. The Pulse Launcher from Israeli company Elbit Systems is another example of a mobile missile system. The primary advantage of such a system is its high efficiency, achieved through a unique guidance system. It utilizes GPS and gyroscopes to ensure high accuracy and maneuverability of the projectile during flight. Poles can fire various types of ammunition at different distances, all from the same position. Each launcher accommodates two standard containers for different types of weapons. Reloading is carried out by swapping the missile containers using a regular crane. 
The system can be mounted on existing truck platforms and will operate in various weather conditions. The system is ready for action in just a few minutes, making it an excellent choice for surprise attacks. The Royal Air Force recently conducted tests of a unique reconnaissance drone. What makes it unique? American company Anduril has developed a foldable helicopter-style reconnaissance drone called Ghost 4. When folded, it measures 3.6 feet in length. The unmanned aerial vehicle UAV can carry out reconnaissance missions independently and simply notify the operator of detected objects. Even more interestingly, drones can be combined into a group with no limit on the number of units. The Ghost Force fuselage has an external appearance similar to a rifle, but the overall design follows a traditional helicopter layout. The drone's length is 8.85 feet, while its height and width are 1.3 feet each. The most intriguing feature of the fuselage is its foldability, allowing the UAV to be transported in a carrying case. In addition to these features, the drone is electric. It is capable of conducting flights lasting more than 100 minutes. Working on a minesweeper poses serious risks to the crew. Therefore, major countries are seeking ways to automate the process using specialized robots. The U.S. Navy already uses the Raytheon AN-AQS-20C system for mine destruction. The system is based on the autonomous MCM USV vessel from American company Textron. The minesweeper's range via radio channel is 87 miles, with an autonomous operation duration of 20 hours. The AQS-20 sonar is installed on the vessel, which detects and classifies mines. The detected munitions are destroyed using the Barracuda underwater robot. The device receives targeting information, approaches the mine, and detonates it using an onboard explosive charge. Unmanned MCM USV vessels are designed to carry various mine countermeasure equipment. Ships of the LCS Coastal Zone class and auxiliary vessels of the American fleet are already equipped with such drones. The main disadvantage of rocket launchers is their high cost and the need for crew training. The U.S. Air Force has solved these problems with the help of the pelletized rocket system Rapid Dragon. The Rapid Dragon design is so simple, it's almost laughable. It's just an ordinary transport pallet for a forklift equipped with rail guides. Depending on the requirements, one pallet can hold from 6 to 9 units of weaponry. When fewer rockets are dropped, the enemy slots are filled with ballast. The assembled system is loaded onto the MC-130J Hercules transport aircraft. As the plane approaches the designated point, the Rapid Dragon pallet is pushed towards the open cargo hatch. After that, a drag parachute pulls it out of the aircraft. In flight, the system's main parachute deploys and the rocket launcher hangs from the straps. Rockets are released one by one from their slots, unfold their wings, start their engines, and head towards their program targets. The projectile's range is 575 miles. Notably, the final destination of the munition can be changed directly during its flight. Military equipment producers are becoming more and more interested in kamikaze drones. These devices are easy to control, lightweight, and allow for precision strikes on specific targets. The Israeli Spike Firefly drone is a small helicopter-style unmanned aerial vehicle UAV, with two coaxial counter-rotating propellers. The device weighs only 6.6 .6 pounds. Spike Firefly is operated by a compact remote control. The operator can command the drone to strike a specific target and, if necessary, cancel the attack. In this case, the device will return to the operator. The weapon can be used against both moving and stationary targets. The device has a height of just 15.7 inches and a diameter of 3 inches. Its operational range is 0.3 miles in urban areas and 0.6 miles in open terrain. The UAV is equipped with one or two battery packs and can stay airborne for 15 to 30 minutes.
humanity is constantly improving technologically. And to stay up to date with the latest inventions, be sure to subscribe to the channel. If you liked the video, don't forget to like it. See you next time.